Hello everyone, welcome back to Hate Plus. Okay, before we delve into day three of the female harem route, I want to talk a little bit about the endings to the game. And the various pathways and things like that. Okay, so to sum up, I've, I've been on a completionist streak with this game. Um, I have played this game for like 21 hours or something like that, and this is now my 14th freaking recording session, which is mind-blowing to me. I, I can't believe I've played this game this long. And I went back through all of my videos and looked at all of the different endings that I've gotten so far. And I've gotten six different endings. And these are them. I've gotten... Actually, let me begin the day. Because this music is kind of loud and it's making it hard to think, and I feel like I'm kind of yelling to hear my own voice. Ah. <sighs> Much better. Okay, so I've experienced six endings so far. And in order of... In order of um, when they occurred, was this. I had Survivor's Testimony ending, that was with Hyane. Then I had Mute Sidekick ending, that was with, well, Mute, obviously, as my sidekick. And then I had the Impossible Harem ending. And these are the, their exact names copied from the end title screen, by the way. So yeah, I did I did the Hyane route, then I did the Mute route, then I did the Harem route. And then I started playing through them again as a female and trying different things. So after the Impossible Harem ending, I got the Mute Alone ending, where Mute was not my sidekick. I told her, no, I don't want you with me. Then the fifth ending was the Hyane Alone ending, where I told her I don't want her with me. I don't want her as my sidekick. And then after that, I got the Caged Bird ending, which is where you tell her that um, she can't have a body, so you keep her caged. Yeah, so I've experienced six different endings, and I believe there's one more. Uh, well, there, there's one more that I know of, or at least that I'm pretty sure exists. For some reason, I've had trouble actually finding a, a concrete list of the different endings. I know it's out there, but for some reason, I can't find it. But for now, this is how this is going to go down. I don't think there are any alternative harem endings. So I'm pretty sure my playthrough of the harem ending that I'm doing right now as a female, is probably not going to result in a different ending. Now, of course, I'm going to try it regardless. And I'm going to try different options. I'm, I'm trying to, like, break them apart and treat them like shit, basically. To see if I can get something different to happen. Even though it makes me feel freaking terrible, but... <sighs> For science! But yes, I'm pretty sure this is not going to produce a different ending. However, afterwards, I'm going to attempt to get the seventh ending that I think I know of. And I will show you what that is when we get to it. So for now, let's just go ahead and see if I can get something different to happen um, for this female harem route. Okay, good morning. Let's get back to reading, I guess. Alright, so yeah, this is after she tried to kill herself, but Hyane stopped her. Can we talk in private, please? Oh god, I'm gonna be such a dick to say no, but... <sighs> <sighs> Gotta stay committed, right? Stay the course. Stay the dick course. No. Look, it's really important. I really think you need to know this. Oh, wow, she tells you anyway. Okay. Okay, so... This is going to be interesting. Because I have a lot of options here. On the third day of the hair mending, you have a lot of... Choices that you can make. Let's go with this. Don't be a coward. Really? Well, if you say so. Here's your chance to roll back out of this decision if you changed your mind. <laughs> the game is basically telling me you just made the wrong choice. But trust me. Trust me, game. I know. I did it on purpose. Mute. Don't be such a coward. Killing yourself is the cheap way out. <laughs> like you're one to talk. Oh god. <laughs> what have I done? What have I done? A construct built on the memories of the Pale Bride, a woman who killed herself in the process of committing genocide, lecturing me on the cheap way out? Don't you dare, you bitch. Holy crap, I think this might have actually worked, everyone. I just realized. M maybe I can't actually break them apart. I mean, Mute is calling Yane a bitch. So, there's a pretty good chance they're um, not going to like each other after this. 
Okay. Hmm. I don't think that was the best thing to say. No. And I mean, I don't kill... Uh, I didn't kill myself. I'm still alive. I wish you'd treat me like that. But I guess that isn't what's important right now. Should I apologize? Huh. Hmm. Then don't be like me. Well, don't be like me seems to piss Hyane off the most. So, God. I guess I'm gonna go with it. This game is filling me with self-loathing. Or, or rather, I mean, it's not like the game's forced the feeling onto me. But my decision to be a completionist and try these different horrible options has filled me with self-loathing. I, I kind of hate myself. Then don't be like me. Then don't be like me. I... This is really hard to say. <sighs> be better than me. Don't just abandon your responsibilities because you f felt like things were too hard. Responsibilities? I just... It's not as if I have anything to live for anymore. God damn... Ah, shit, this is actually working. That's not good. That's not what I want. There's no point to my continued existence. It's just a burden on others. If all I'm going to do is make things harder for other people, then maybe it's just time the Widow of the Magungwa does the right thing. Mute. Hmm. None of these are terribly dickish. Well, I guess this one's kind of. Stay alive to make up for failing me before. <laughs> Stay alive to make up for failing me before. Failed you? How? Okay, this is working. <laughs> this is actually working. Well, hmm. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez. It's hard to be confrontational, but okay, you said it was the right thing, so I'm going to do it anyway. Yeah, get back in there, Hine. You didn't protect me from my parents. You never even tried to find out if there was something the matter. Your first, your first duties were to my husband, the Emperor, weren't they? Yes, but... Don't you think that also means you had a duty to protect his future wife from harm? Don't... don't you think? I... well... I guess it's just... that's just one more item on the long list of things I can't do right, isn't it? Like, no matter how you look at it, I don't have what it takes to help you. I'm not stupid. I can tell by the investigators' reactions. I mean, they're a good person, for sure, but still. Earth is going to be more like your time, more like the time we're reading about, than anything I know. What do I say? What do I say? What do I say? Hmm. None of these are horrible. Hmm. Well, this one's kind of weak sauce. Just finish what you started, at least. Yeah, just finish what you started, at least. Just one more day. Don't make any harsh decisions before we finish. I... Well... Okay. It actually worked. I realize that... You know how there are a lot of files that just look like junk data? Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's get back to work together, Mute. Okay. Alright. Well, let's machine gun through these messages. We're gonna MLG speedrun these messages. So yeah, um, the seventh ending that I think I can get is back from my... I guess I'll go back to my original playthrough. My first one. Um, the ending is that at near the end, you get to choose... Uh, like she, she asks you something like, should I testify? And I think you can tell her, no, yes, or it's up to you. And I chose it's up to you, and she said that... Uh, with me by her side, uh, she thinks she can do it. So that's why I got the survivor's testimony ending, because I told her it was up to her whether she wants to testify or not, and she decided to. So I think you can get a different ending if you say no. Because then it's not the survivor's testimony ending, it's something else. Because she doesn't testify. Take a break.
But it's only been like 10 seconds. All right, fine, fine. Hey, I think we should take a break. Mute. Sure, whatever, yeah. And what do I say? <laughs> Let's go with the really stupid option. Cheer up! Mute. I know you just learned about all, you know, your past life and uh, betrayal and being brought up in lies and all that, but, you know, buck up. Cheer up, please. How am I supposed to do that? <laughs> No matter how you look at it, I'm worthless. I had one job. One job. Keep the Magungwa safe. Hmm. Well, this one seems to piss Hyane off the most, so let's go with this. It wasn't your fault. Please, don't take responsibility for me. You didn't even have proper security permissions, right? Right? I guess. Are you saying that was your fault that you weren't able to read the log files encrypted by my family? It's not that simple. But it's not your fault, right? Won't you admit that it's at least not your fault that you couldn't read those? Okay. But still, I could have protested and tried to get elevated security permissions. Was it your fault that my husband changed the root password to my name? Wait. Wait, 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 hold, wait. Was it your fault that my husband changed the root password to my name? Oh, hold on, every Things are swimming around my mind now, I'm trying to process that. The root password. What, what happened with the root password? Mute gave it up. I, it's so hard to remember what happened with the freaking root password. <sighs> what happened? Mute gave it up to Ryu. Ryu changed it. So that he was now in control of it. Right? My husband changed the root password to my name. Was this... Is she talking about back in Analog... A Hate Story time? Like in the last game? Uh, like, I'm getting my timelines mixed up, and I'm forgetting names at this point. Because I have a really bad memory, and there's also a lot of information in these two games. Has... I don't know. Wait a minute. Back in the original game... Isn't that how I logged in? That's how I got elevator permissions, right? By logging in with her name. Wait, that's the root password? I was logging in with the root password when I did that? Okay, okay, now I've got it. Never mind. I should have said something. You would have argued with the Emperor. I... Maybe if I had, everyone would still be alive. <sighs> and she's hating herself because she's a woman. I just wish she'd stop shouting at me. I'm just trying to help. Well, hugging her actually worked, and was also totally adorable. And very, very sweet. But, of course, we're not going with that route. Yo back! <laughs> oh god. Oh jeez. If you think that's best... Oh god, how's this gonna go? But doing that is... practicing. Just calm down. Just... Just listen to me. No, that wasn't quite. Just listen to me, you stupid, awful, self-centered jerk. There you go, Hyane. Yeah, get into it. I don't think that was good either. Alright, I'll try again. Just listen to me. Oh well, here goes nothing. Are you done conspiring with your girlfriend yet? Mute, please, shut up. Just please, live up your name just this once for one single minute and let me speak. Mute, the universe scares me too. Earth might be more like the place I dreamed of than the place I woke up in. But I'm just like you, Mute. We grew up in the same society, learned to serve in the same royal women's quarters. I don't know how to deal with the Earth I dreamed of any better than you do. I need someone who can be with me, to support me. I know you're scared, but I'm scared too. 
Okay, yeah, this is this is the same so far. I maybe. Uh... Okay, and this is where she confesses that she she loves her. Okay, the, I was really curious about these options, but I never actually chose them. Which one did I go with? I think I went with because of what we read about old mute. This one is just weird. It's a secret. Like, what the hell kind of an question? What kind of an option is that? And naturally, because I'm curious, I'm gonna go with it. Sorry, it's a secret. You'll just have to trust me. I've learned a lot about you over the past three days. Okay, okay. What do I have to lose? Seriously, that convinced her? I'll, I'll believe in you. Wow, okay. I'm still mute. AI in charge of Magungwa security operations. I still have a job to do. Yes, you do. Well, she didn't confess that she loved her. Was that supposed to happen there? Or does that happen later on? Because, I mean, if she doesn't confess, if Hyunae doesn't confess that she loves Mute, could you possibly get a different ending? I I'm pretty sure there's only one harem ending, but I don't know. And after I finish this ending, by the way, and then after I go back to check out the non-testimony ending with Hyane, I'm actually going to do even more, but I'll talk about that at the end. Okay, two more blocks to read. I really can't believe I'm being such a completionist about this game. Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to click that, but what the hell. Alright, let's extract more while I'm out here. Is something wrong with me? I've put 20 hours into a... Uh, what, what was at the time of release a $9 visual novel. I've put 20 hours into it. Oh my god. Well, since I'm on a roll, I'm just going to go ahead and extract them all. Okay. There are going to be a lot of messages I've now gathered up. Oh, maybe this is where she confesses that she loves Mute? I'm really glad. You've been in love before, right? Okay, okay, yeah, this is where she confesses. Does 
she think I'm in love with her? What do I say to her? Okay, what if I say nothing? Is she, is she actually going to say nothing? I can't just say nothing. It would be the easy thing to do. It's the thing I have the most practice doing. I can't do that. Say nothing again? No, okay, you can't do that. Yeah. Tell her how you feel. Mute, um... Mute, I like you. Okay, good to hear. <laughs> no, no, Hyena, you need to come on stronger, okay? She didn't get it. Speak from the heart. I'm in love with you. And then she thinks it's a joke, right? Oh, no, no. No, she's convinced. <laughs> uh. That's what I was afraid she'd say. Okay, um... Anything that comes to mind. <laughs> Is it really such a good idea? I should think it through. Okay, 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 fine. Uh, you're... Admirable. You know, isn't this near where the game crashed last time? I just realized that. Let me save, just in case. Yeah, I, I'm really thinking that be playing a, a female in the harem route instead of a male really doesn't seem to change much of anything. What do I say? You're cute. Yeah, this is all the same so far. What do I say? Anything that comes to mind. Or anything that comes to mind. Or, you know, I think this is the right one. Yeah, the other the other two are wrong. Go with anything that comes to mind. their argument about their age. No, I'm 300 years older than you. Never thought I'd hear anyone argue about being 300 years older than someone else. That's for sure. <laughs> okay, I don't think you can break them up. Which, for my sanity, is actually kind of a good thing. Because I feel like a total extra super douchebag. Even douchier than I've been these past couple playthroughs. Yeah, god, the mute is so... Uh, the, the, what did I just say? The mute? What the fuck? The maid. There. Those are proper words. The maid is so freaking adorable. I mean, get the... Oh my god. Wait, 
Wait, did she actually say something about the maid? Oh yeah, did you see the picture of the maid? She's cute. Okay, almost done. Yeah, I'm like 99% sure that the ending is not going to be different. Okay, I think that's the last one. Oh no, never mind. Three more. Can't forget that scroll bar. Actually, it's not a bar. Scroll... What would you call that? It's not even a... Whoops. Okay. It's not even a bar, it's a dot. And what's more than that, it's it's, it's a non-functioning dot. You can't even grab it. Okay, that's it. So I guess this is it then. Yes, it is. Well, that's all there is to read before we return to Earth. Yep, so I think it's all going to be the same. Yep, this is all the same so far. Is there anything I any options I can do to change anything? I don't think so. Everything worked out completely perfectly. Yes, it did. There was an easy solution to everything. We both got the girl, nobody got hurt. I know, it's almost like it's an it's almost like it's an impossible hair amending. That makes no sense within the universe and totally breaks the fourth wall and all that. Whoops! And nothing in the past really had any sort of consequence in the end. Exactly! See, everyone's happy, everything's fine, nothing mattered. Yep. I just love a perfectly happy ending. This is uh, what I always dreamed of, and I guess dreams can come true after all. Alright, what's the big dramatic concluding line we're going to end on? It should be good so you can screen cap it for posterity. Uh, just go with this one again. Just kiss her. <laughs> That's a perfect thing to end with. A kiss. How romantic. <laughs> hey, little sister mute. <laughs> no, jeez, get away from me. And now we're about to get, yep, this song again. As much as I love this song and would love to listen to it again, I've got things to do. God, I love this song. Impossible Harem Ending. Yep, it's the same one. This song is so good. Space Detective. Love story. Okay, no, stop, stop singing. I'm, I'm just gonna go crazy on it again and sing the whole thing if I keep going. So, while that is playing, let me go back to my original playthrough, which was when? Let's find out. <laughs> uh, that was my uh, my analog save file. The investigator, an unmarried man who misses Earth, returns home with the love struck Hyun who feels strongly that her love is true. Ah. Okay, so this is my original playthrough with Hyane. Alright, so that's the last one, August 21st. So this has got to be near the end. Actually, this is the end, isn't it? Okay, I don't know if this is before or after we've had the discussion about, about testifying, so let's find out. I guess that's all then. Next time we talk, we'll be on Earth. Okay, so th that's after. Yeah, that's the uh, survivor's testimony ending. Yep, there, that's her testifying. Yep. Alright, so hold on. Let's go back to the one before that. Hopefully it wasn't from too long ago. God, look at all these different playthroughs. Oh, whoa, actually, that is, uh, it's like 20, 30 minutes previous. But it is day three, so. Alright, looks like there's some more to extract. I can't remember exactly where the conversation about testifying happened, but I'm guessing it's when you're done reading all of the documents. 
you know, when she says, this is it. Like, so, so I guess this is it. I'm guessing it's there. Oh, whoops. Yeah, the interface is kind of weird. Like, there's lots of spots where it seems like if you click it, it just takes you back for some reason. Okay. So this is it? Yep. So, we've read everything we can before we return to Earth, I suppose. How do you feel about what we've read? Um, let's go with what I did before. Sympathetic. Good sidekick. Well, I've already gotten her her alone ending, so there's no reason to mess with this. Yes, you're the best. Alright, so what about testifying? Will you give me a body, please? Yep. Okay, here we go. Will you make me testify about the Magungwa? What I did. Here we go. Alright, so this should give me a different ending. Let me save it. So if I say you should, or it's your decision at this point, um... She will. She will testify. I'll get the survivor's testimony ending. So this time I'm going to say you shouldn't. Ah, thank you for understanding. Wait, 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 what? You shouldn't is me being understanding? I would... I think it's your decision is being understanding. You shouldn't is being bossy, but okay. I mean, I know. Uh, I mean, I know. What happened to the Magungwa was super important, and I guess I'm a part of that. But some sort of Inquisition. I can't deal with that at all. So... Thank you for understanding. Well, anyway, I suppose it's now almost time to begin Star System. Yep. Okay. We'll be on Earth. I can't wait. I can't wait. All right, let's see. Is this... Yep, this is different. All right, so that's her being put into her body. But it's a different picture. Aww. <laughs> Look at Sharp. Shanae's honeymoon ending. Okay. I'm going to write that in my list right now. Shanae's... Honeymoon ending. That is my seventh ending. In order of events, I had Survivor's Testimony ending, Mute Sidekick ending, Impossible Harem ending, Mute Alone ending, Shanae Alone ending, Caged Bird ending, and now, Shanae's Honeymoon ending. Okay, so here's what's gonna happen now. Let me save this. Yes, I wanna save that, thank you. Okay. Um, so like I said near the beginning, I think it was near the beginning, I don't know if there are other endings. I had a hard time finding any list. And the one list, which is unconfirmed, that I did find suggested that these ones that I just did are the only endings, the seven. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do some more research. I'm going to look at the different, uh, look for lists of different endings and stuff like that. And if there are any more, I will come back and do a video going through them. So regardless of anything else, if there are more endings and I find out about them, I'm going to do a video going through them. However, there's also something else I'm going to do. See, a commenter asked me something that got my mind working. Someone said, uh, I don't remember, uh, I'm paraphrasing here, I don't remember exactly what was said, but it was something like, have you played, uh, have you done like, you know, multiple playthroughs or a full completion of Analog Hate Story, the original game? And I thought, wait a minute, I haven't. I'm being a completionist with Hate Plus, the second game. But why haven't I done that with Analog A Hate Story? Yep, can you guess what's coming? So, if there are any more endings for this game, I will do a video for that. But regardless of that, I'm definitely going to be doing some videos of some sort, or a video, going over Analog of Hate Story, being a completionist for that. Because when I played Analog of Hate Story, I only played through it once, and I played through it... Uh, my playthrough of that was with taking Hyunae with me. So, 
There, I, I have no idea what the other pathways are exactly. I know there's another pathway where you take Mute with you. And there's also the ending where you take both with you. You know, the, the three main routes that you have in Hate Plus are also the three main routes that you can end with in Analog Hate Story. So yeah, I don't know exactly how those work and how much content of that is new or anything like that, but I am going to find out. So look forward to that after this. So in summary, there is... I've now completed seven endings for this game. And if I find out about any more endings, I will do a video of them. And regardless of whether there are any more endings for this game or not, I'm going to do at least one additional video going through and being a completionist with Analog A Hate Story. So, I hope everyone has enjoyed my crazy... weird and sometimes horrible because I've been treating people like shit to see what happens, uh, completionist playthroughs. And I will be back soon with more insane visual novel completionist behavior. Because for some reason I've turned insane and feel like I need to see every single little tiny bit of dialogue that exists within, the, within these games. And I have no idea why. Somebody help me. Actually, no, please don't help me because I'm actually having a lot of fun doing this. <laughs> okay, hope you enjoyed. Goodbye.